What up chess players and my friends? This is gonna be a bit of a weird video, a bit unusual. We're gonna go through how it's the quickest checkmate going to happen with each piece. So let's say for example, the quickest checkmate with the queen, we all know it, it's e4, f6, and then whatever you wanna do, knight, c3, whatever, g5, and then checkmate in h5, right? So three moves. The quickest checkmate with the bishop would be very similar and it's uh, f6 and then bishop to e2. So basically just replacing the queen at the diagonal. And then g5, bishop h5. So now that we've gone through the easy ones, it's gonna be your turn to prove me how smart you are and uh, see what your logical skills are about and find the quickest checkmate you can possibly find with the pawn, okay? So pause the video now, write down your idea in the comment section and come back for the solution in three, two, one. And the checkmate with the pawn would be in one, and then f5, 2, g6, 3, then knight to h6, and now 4, the fourth move is bishop c4, supporting the f7 square, the most vulnerable square for the black player, and after the knight purposely goes to f7 just to do us a favor, pawn takes, and that's checkmate with the pawn, right? Five moves, was it five? Ah, uh, can't even bother counting. Anyway, let's go back, and now your turn again. Find the quickest checkmate with the rook. This is just warming up, okay? We're just warming up here. We're re getting ready for the quickest checkmate with the king, which is going to be a pain in the... I mean, a thorn in the back, or whatever you said. So find the quickest checkmate with the rook now. Pause the video now. Blah, 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 blah. And yeah. The solution is h4, just to start. g5, pawn takes. Okay, so just to open the file for the rook. Now, all we need to do is take all of these pieces and back rank mate the black king. So, bishop to f6, one of the defenders of the king, we take it. And after the knight, doesn't take us because, yeah, the black player is just doing us favors today. Rook to h7. And now we're threatening checkmate. The knight can block the checkmate, so this knight really needs to piss off. So, knight to h5, or whatever, any other square. Rook to h8 is mate. And now we're going to do the checkmate with the knight. The quickest checkmate with the knight is quite easy. So again, pause the video now. Remember to write down in the comments so that we can challenge each other or potentially just uh, uh, emotionally abuse other users. Uh, that's the thing I prefer. And then come back for the solution in 3, 2, 1. So the quickest checkmate with the knight is going to be in... Let's see how many moves. I haven't even counted them. Knight f3, and then c6, because we need the square d6, a very vulnerable square when the knight goes to d6. Um, then the knight goes to d4, e6, and then the third move is knight to b5. And now the black player plays this move, knight to e7. And that is exactly what allows us to do a checkmate with the knight in four moves. So knight d6 is made. And now last but not least, I'm going to ask you to find the checkmate with the king. It's going to take eight moves. Okay, so now you know it. Pause the video now. Oh my god, I'm so tired of saying it. Let's just, just, just get to the point. Solution is, okay, we're going to start with d4, like the most miserable type of person, and then e5. Bishop to f4. And now pawn takes, queen takes d4. Okay, so good development for the white players. Now king e7, the king has to come forward. And after king to d2, we're involving our king. We have to give a check with the king, so the king has to play. Black will play queen to e8. Uh, just kill the time, you know. And now the, the white player goes on with king to e3. So now the black has to play like a stupid move. Let's say uh, knight a6 or something like that. King to e4 comes now. And this is what we need. We need a discover check. If you thought when you clicked on this video, if you thought that you were going to give a checkmate with the king, man, you are so dumb. No, no, I don't want to insult you. You're not dumb. You're just... Uh, yeah, well, dumb is the only thing that... The only per, the only word that comes to mind. Anyway, now the black player plays something else, b6, and white prepares the checkmate. Queen e3. The black queen goes back to d8, move 7, and now move 8 is the winning move. King to f5. This is checkmate. That comes with a king move, even though the checkmate is delivered by the queen. But I didn't know that. Funny how the a game ended, the checkmate with the king ended with a d4 game. I, I actually feel quite dirty for playing d4 as a first move. 
But obviously, this is evidence that this was just a demonstration. Uh, to this day of my life, I'm proud to say I've never played D4 in an actual game in my entire life. And hopefully for the next 100 years. Anyway, I wish you a great rest of the day and I'll talk to you soon. And remember to like and subscribe if you haven't done so yet.